Hello, wild people. We're back with Ladies' Ark. I know, I could have come up with something more original, but I didn't. Ladies' Ark is a sandbox mode. Oh no, my bit my deetle. I don't know what deetle is, but I like it. My beetle died. Oh no, everything is dying. And now a meerkat has also passed. Oh, goodness. Okay, so welcome to Ladies' Ark, where it's obviously full of love and life. Look how busy it's starting to get, though. This is crazy. Anyway, we are... Okay. For those that have been watching the channel and know me and you've been here a long time, you'll know that I never finish a zoo. Like, I just, I get to a point in my life where I give up. I'm just a bit of a giver up. Anyway, so the whole point in Lady's Ark, and this is kind of why I went for the Ark theme, you know, like Noah's Ark, all the animals on the Noah's Ark, blah, blah, blah. Yeah, uh, so we're going to have every animal on this zoo and we're going to try and fill out the whole thing uh that's basically my plan so i think this is animal number 12 i don't know actually so our last episode we had dingoes which is cool if you guys want to see from the start i do actually have a planet zoo playlist go and check it out so we've got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten Oh, I have 10 animals. Oh, man, I thought I had 12. Anyway, we actually put in some rhinos here in this very oddly shaped thing. And we've got a baby rhino. I didn't even know that we had a baby rhino. This is awesome. But guys, if you're new to the channel, go ahead, subscribe, turn on that notification bell, please. If you could help us grow this channel, that would be wonderful. We're only a small channel at the moment, but hey, hey, watch this space. You never know. I'm not going to quit. I'm going to try really hard not to quit this channel. Um, so if you guys could give me any uh, encouragement or just give us a like on the video, that'd be super helpful because I do need all the encouragement I get. I'm such a big baby. Okay, so we had an Australian zoo, Australian zoo, Australia section here, which we still have one, maybe two more animals to add to. Uh, we've had a desert corner, which I'm pretty sure I've missed a couple of uh, animals, but you know, I've never seen the camel go on the rock before. That was, that was very confusing. And then, uh, yeah, then we made our way over here to sort of India yeah it looks great right yeah india's a bit scruffy but it's fine we need to put some like trees and stuff in and possibly make it look a bit nicer especially around here just make it a bit more indiany i don't know if i've got any indiany things in let's have a look a second indian oh i wonder if there's like a whole like centerpiece of indian stuff there's like indian sculptures i kind of want something pre-made because i'm lazy like this thing like what that's a temple thing isn't it let's put temples uh yeah to show that we are going to india we'll just put a big temple thing there i don't know if that's gonna work to be honest um innovation center jurassic world evolution oh someone actually made that it's so cool people are so clever there uh, i downloaded this monkey temple from the sand what do you call it the workshop i did i did from the workshop and uh it's beautiful might i add it's actually stunning but we're not going to use that because i feel like that is that's cheating a little bit too much isn't it i feel like it's probably cheating a bit too much let's just get some trees in here i don't know why or how this is like an indian thing here oh look peacocks actually where did i put the peacocks because oh there nice guys look you can actually get a a statue with them oh that's cool yeah let's put it up on a big rock thing here yeah that looks cool actually because i've been Kind of wanting to put the odd thing in. Look, an Indian elephant temple. Where can I stick that? I mean, I could put it over the back here, but I don't know if that looks a bit rubbish. Again, that's another... But then, yeah, I suppose that's another thing I've downloaded and not done myself, like a lazy bum that I am. Oh, look, a big peacock statue thing. Whoa! That's sick. Uh, yeah, I'm definitely going to put that, like... Yeah, I'm going to put that, like, right there. And then people can be like, look how pretty that is. Okay, that's great. So what animal are we putting today? I don't I don't know what we're putting in today. I have no idea. I kind of think maybe we should stick to the Indian section. Maybe we should add uh, another Australian little creature thing in. Or maybe we could just do something completely new. I think if we keep going completely new, we're going to end up running out of space, aren't we? So let's see what animals we've got, like, Australian-y. And I'm not sure what we have left i think there's an emu -y bird thing um so i've got to try and remember off the top of my head which ones are from australia maybe i should go to zoopedia in this instance and uh once we've done ladies arc guys somebody said why don't you make uh critically endangered 
uh, zoo. And I was like, oh, that's a great idea. So all the animals next are going to be like critically endangered and blah, 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 and stuff like that. So let's have continent. Uh, Oceana then. Is that Australian? It must be. Yes. Ha, ah, platypus. Why did I not think of this? What an absolute donut. Okay, so I think what we're going to go with next. Okay, this is my plan then. We'll put in a platypus today. And we need to put the southern cassowary. Sounds like a casserole. Yeah, let's put... Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the little platypus guy in here. And we're going to have a little hedgerow for them, I think. Um, And thank you to... Uh, what did I just do? How did I even move it like that? Thank you to all my uh, subscribers currently and to everyone who like comments and just makes the channel nice. Oh no, what's going on now? What's... Why? What's going on? Oh no, don't tell me there's 15 of these in here. Did I not put self-manage on here? Oh my goodness. Guys, look how many beetles there are. Oh no. Have you guys seen the advert for the new beetle? That like blue beetle film thing. It's very strange. Our camels are going to die as well, aren't they? Oh my goodness. Okay, we need to go to... Oh, look at the baby elephants. The elephants are to die for. Um. Okay. Uh, oh, the peacocks have gone mental as well. Oh my goodness. When did we even have this many baby peacocks? I don't know how to keep everything under control. Because I feel like everything else is going to inbreed otherwise. Do you know what I mean? Uh, that's Lady's Ark. Oh, I've got a koala here that's randomly like... These two are too old. They can't have a baby. Oh my goodness. Okay, this is... This is stressful. Um, these two need to go as well. Oh my goodness. We're going to need to buy a load more animals and just... Oh, Okay, bye-bye, beetles. We're going to need to buy a load more animals. Just, like, replenish all of the exhibits. <laughs> this is so crazy. Okay, we'll just get rid of those. Uh, let's just get rid of... Oh, I have no idea. I think everybody's going to be inbred there. Let's go release to the wild. Okay, I've released everyone to the wild. Hopefully everyone will be happy. And then let's set this to management. Manage population. The beetles. For goodness sake, what is going on? Okay, so... Yeah, let's fill this little space here with the platypus. Not really had the platypus much. I had them what... Actually, don't they need quite a lot of area? Because don't you need, like, swimming area? I might have to, like... I might have to wing it around the back there, actually. Let's have a look. Cool. Um... Let's have a look here. Oh, right. No. Um, okay. Well, let's align to grid here instead. And let's just build around the back. I don't know how big the platypus want their enclosure. I can't remember. I feel like they need a lot of... If I remember rightly, I feel like they need a lot of water. But I might be wrong. So let's just... I mean, let's have a look. I don't think they need, like, loads of space. But we'll see. At least uh, well, we'll build what I was going to build. Let's get rid of that random bit of path. Nobody needs that. And uh, hopefully, hopefully, guys, we'll uh, have enough space for them. That'd be good. Uh, can I delete this little bit of path? Oh, no, maybe not. Can I delete that? Oh, I can. That's nice. Okay. Um... I don't know if this is going to work or not. Let's look. Okay, I'll just pull this out slightly because that's going to annoy me otherwise. Okay, that's possibly more than enough space. But uh, let's put in a barrier -y thing. How do you find the level of the music on this game, by the way? Is it too much or not enough? Let me know in the comment section below. I might just up it a bit, actually. Oh, no, it should be okay, actually. Should be okay about there. Yeah, okay, fine. Should be okay. Right, yo, let's move on. So... Animal trading. Let's have a look at the platypus. So, I think, again, only one each. One. I don't know who's the better one there. One female. One male. Let's go Zoopedia. They need, they need like, no space. But they do need quite a bit of water. That's why it doubles up and you end up needing quite a bit more space. Okay, so let's put in... Okay, so let's put in... That is a big old bit of water. I, I can imagine this is more than a hundred and... Yeah, it's 700 metres. That's fine. And then we'll just put in, like, a water thing here. Actually, we could make it a natural enclosure as well. 
Um, but I, I won't risk it for a chocolate biscuit today. Let's not do that. Yeah, that's probably enough water. And do I have... I don't know what I have anymore. Do I have a water treatment centre somewhere? Probably not. Oh, the Titan be Beetle is still... Are you done yet? Are you done moaning? The Beetle... Oh, Beetle has died though. Oh, it's had offspring, that's why. What's going on? Beetles, man. Oh my goodness, do I have literally like... I have two gems box left. Gems box. Oh my goodness, okay, well... Okay. I think it'll be fun though going around and actually just putting in a load of new animals actually. Loads of stuff just dying right now, which is not great. Oh my goodness, the fennec foxes are like going to be game over soon as well. Oh, look at all these beetles. Oh my goodness, okay, let's just keep one female and one male. Let's do that. Well, keep the gold one, you donut. Okay. Okay, hopefully it the exhibit's now empty. What? Did I sell them all? I'm so confused. I'm very, very confused, everyone. I thought I had two beetles left. Yeah, I have two beetles. Move into here. I'm very confused. Where did they go in the first place? I'm very confused now, everyone. Oh, I told you this zoo was going to start getting a bit stressful. Somebody was going to inbreed there as well. Have they? Nope. Okay, we seem to be okay. Oh my goodness, this is so crazy. All I want to do is put in some platypus. It's all I want to do in my day. I'm going to put a teeny tiny path through the middle here, actually. Hopefully no one will notice. And then actually we could probably put in another enclosure there if we really need. Actually, we probably put shops and stuff in there as well. Which we do need more of, thinking of it. Indian peafowl has had babies. Okay, let's go to animal trading and animal storage. And we're going to put our platypus in. Oh my goodness. Stressful. Talk about stressful. Okay, let's edit the barrier. I think the best place for these guys to have a viewing is probably here. Uh, because otherwise people are going to be really weird. Okay, facilities. What do we need? Platypus. Oh, here they come, I think. Oh no, that's just a janitor. Oh no, someone actually is about to- stop! Stop, 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 stop! Oh my goodness. Okay. You guys are stressing me out. The peacocks are mental. I don't know how people keep on track of all of it. You know, when you've got a massive zoo, I don't know how people do it. And I hope my game's not going to lag when we have loads of animals suddenly in. Okay, so we've got a platypus hopefully on the way. Let's just uh, speed up things here. While we're possibly waiting for them, let's put our boring stuff in. We want an Australian theme as well. Australia, nice. Okay, well, we want like, um... Don't get much for Australia, really, which is a little bit annoying. Oh, here they come. It's, it's currently dark, though. That's really annoying. Oh, look! How cute is that? That's cute. Uh, let me just sort this, these times out of the day, because this is painful. Why is it like... Aha, there we go. Oh, I'm a five-star zoo, and I didn't even know. I'm kind of nearly a five-star zoo, even though the people are, like, miserable. Yay, that's exciting. Look at him go, guys, look at him go. Oh, oh, he's gone. Oh, he, like, weirdly glitched. Nice, look at it. I'm going to get a picture because I'm sad. And actually, I do like taking pictures of them. Really cute. Has anybody seen a platypus in real life? Not something I've ever seen. Um, I don't think you get them really here in the UK. I'm pretty sure you don't anyway. Um, I've never seen one, I must admit. Cool. Nice. Okay, cool. I've got my pictures now, guys. Okay, we'll crack on now. Okay, let's just see how we're going to make these happy or not. So let's look at terrain. If you guys want to see a really good uh, YouTuber for it as well, I often say about... Oh no, I've just done that wrong. Delaney, the lady signer, the lady signer. Uh, but I always also say, um, oh, there's plenty of room here. So actually, I could have chopped that off. That's okay. We'll leave it. We'll leave it how it is. Um, I might actually put another staff path. Oh, we cannot fit one, so that's fine. Let's have a look. Uh, Pause build is also another really good uh, g gamer on this channel, on this channel, on this platform, YouTube. He uh, builds Planet Zoo stuff. And it's very good at it. 
Okay, there's not enough short grass, not enough rock. Just done something weird. Where's rock? Here we go. Okay, there's some rock. And then we need some sand. We'll just build little... Kind of like the coarse sand as well. Okay, it's too... Oh, it's too much short grass. All right, we can put loads of sand in then. That's good. I'll put this sand in. Nice. Okay, sand, rock, maybe a bit more rock, rough rock. Um, and that's fine. That that'll be fine. Everything seems to be in the green there. So let's go to habitat a second, and let's just see what the platypus can have, because I think the platypus can have those burrows, which makes life a lot easier. So let's uh, let's see. Yes, they can. They can have the small animal burrow. That's cool. So I'm just gonna pop a burrow back here. And that should be fine, because... And actually, I don't know how many platypus you can fit in one... Oh, yeah, literally is one male and possibly two females. I might put an... I might get another one, but I might not. Okay, let's just go to habitat. They all look pretty happy. They would like small water area, but it's not the end of the world, so that's great. I've got some toys here for them as well. So that's good. Oh, I've got a submarine thing. I love that. I always think it looks really cool. Put some water jets in as well. They're kind of cute. I don't, is that it for the for the toys for them? Oh no, block of frozen fish. Put that maybe here. So they come over a bit more. And they've got water. And I'm pretty sure we have a water treatment, right? Ooh, I hope we do. We don't. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay, right. Okay, okay, okay. I'm glad I checked. Let's have a look. We want, ooh, we don't want the Australia theme. Let's have a look. Water treatment. Okay. That will do. <laughs> okay. That will do. Fennec Fox is about to die of old age. Like, really? Okay, right. Let's go to nature. So they want Oceana, Aquatic, Tropical, Grassland, and Temperate. Yeah, let's get the Australian things in. I think let's get the stones stones in first because I think stones look so much better when they're in. Maspers are wicked. They do so much cool stuff. Love them. I really, really would love a aquatic pack in general uh for this game i just i love it i love it so much like we want dolphins and stuff like that i know people say it's cruel to keep dolphins and stuff what's your opinion on that my opinion is it's difficult it's the dolphin i don't know it's difficult I'm, is it selfish that i love dolphins and i love seeing them um i don't know probably uh let's get this one Um, let's have a look. I don't know why I've ended up putting little rocks there, but it looks alright actually. It doesn't look too too naff. Uh, we probably should carry on that round, but hey ho. We'll just put loads of plants here. We'll make like a, a plant bit. Do you know what I mean? Like reeds. Make it look a bit uh, more used. Oh, it's so dark. It always seems to rain exactly the same time every every day here in Aussie land. Cool, and then there's some cool, yeah, we'll get like the odd palm tree in. I don't know how much coverage they need. All right, they can have quite a lot of coverage. I'm gonna put a palm tree there. Oh, well, I was thinking about putting a palm tree there. Put one here as well. I think it looks quite nice. I love these dog ear plants. Oh, I wish it would stop raining because you can't actually see a thing. It's really annoying. It's like my eyes can't take it. Come on. We do, before I forget, we do actually need somewhere they can eat because i always forget that i might put a small tray in actually i don't i don't think they need a big one they're not very big animals are they I'm just gonna go to animal trading guys i'm gonna look for one more female oh they're a bit rubbish those females all right well let's send to zoo nice and there's a little keeper's hut there and stuff so that's that's cool okay facilities broken down it's probably a vending machine let's face it and we need to go to habitat I think we've got everything. We just nature. I think we're there. They can have a few more things like the fern bush thing. Yeah, I'll just put in some stuff around the bottom here, just to make it look a bit like better. You know what I mean? So, 
Nice. Okay, well, it's not perfect, but it's better than... It's better than nothing. It'll do. For some reason, I'm really loving the, the fun. What's that about? Why am I loving that so much? It's very strange. Because I can put, like, these things all in along here, you see. I think people are going to get clogged up. So if I remember rightly, I think platypus are quite, like, sought after. Ooh, ooh. This could have been a disaster here. Sorry, guys, I got a really cheap uh, squeaky chair. It's very annoying. But I haven't put in any... I haven't put in any... Um, I don't think I'm going to put path there. I think that's terrible. Idea. I will put one bench there. And maybe another one here. Oh, my goodness, it's going to get seriously clogged, isn't it? Put some benches in... Uh -oh. Yeah, I haven't thought this through, but people might get a bit stuck there, but we'll see. Okay, we've got a conservation board. Most painful bit about this. But yeah, if you guys have any ideas and you want to see something particularly on the channel, then let me know. We'll do it, we'll do it. I really need to start making things a bit prettier, I think. I know, I've tr I'm trying to make this one pretty. Uh, but I end up getting a bit bored. Um, so let's have a look at facilities and let's go screen. I need to put in education actually, Lady Ranger. Let's do that. Great. Let's just do normal screen. Oh, there we go. I just stick that there. Let's have a look. Platypus and platypus. I think that's probably enough. I just this is very annoying. I think that's it. And then just put an educational speaker in here. And yeah, we do need donation boxes. Not that it particularly matters because... Let's move this right in the middle, actually. Because uh, we're not actually making... We're not actually needing to make too much money, are we? So that's good. Okay, fabulous. Okay, so there's a little platypus there. We could put a load of shops in here, actually. That might work. It's probably a good idea. So platypus is in. Platypus is... Happy? What's that? Oh, they need deep water. What? Why does my life keep doing this to me? Right, okay. So they need deep water. Can I put water anywhere? Oh. Thought I'd... Okay, I thought I'd cracked this. Okay. Right. Well then. So look at the size of this. Let's go like... Whoa. Really deep. Right. Is that deep enough for them? <laughs> Do you think that's deep enough for them? Hold up. Let's see if that's like... Has it done it? Has it sorted it? Yes, it has just. But it's in the green. Oh, okay. Many people think tickets are underpriced. Okay, that's fine. We have Indian elephants. Life's good. Somebody asked if I would do a timed scenario. I'm like, ooh. Ooh, I don't know. I might do. Let's put some more Aussie stuff like around here. Let's get like... Uh, let's put some more path stuff in. I think let's um, align to grid. And we'll put in like all this stone stuff. I don't even know. Hopefully we can put some more shops in there actually. That's not a bad shout. Let's do that. So facilities. Yes, facilities. We want shops. And we want it. Do we want it Australian themed there? Um, Yeah, facing this way in we could have it Australian themed. Let's chuck in and see what they've got. Theme, Aussie land, Australia. What's this? That's a zoo entrance. We don't need that. Do we need a small toilet? Nope. I did put some ugly ones in. Um, Where's the entrance to this thing? Oh, yeah. We could just put that, like, there, I guess. And that's a large shell shop, which um, we could, we've got enough of. Let's face it. We've got enough of. So I'll just put a little shop in there, I think. And uh, I'll get rid of the Australian thing. And actually, I'll just put in some other stuff. Why is there a random tire there? Did that come with the... Just put an ATM in there randomly. And yeah, okay, right. We want drinks because they're always going to want a drink. They probably want gulpy. I always read it as Gazeppi for some reason. Gazeppi, what was that? That's from like a film, isn't it? Can't remember. Um, And then we can put in these ugly... Let's get rid of the Align to Grid thing. So that's another drink. Pip Shop smoothie and i can't fit another one in so that's excellent 
Some of it's themed, some of it is not, but we'll go with it. We'll go with it. So, uh, I'll put in some of these plant things, make it a little bit more Australian-y. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Just should, we'll try and make it a bit more Australian-y. Okay. Sort of got over doing that, hasn't it now, which is good. Oh, it looks a bit better. Just if in doubt, just stick a load of plants around it and it'll be fine. Like like the tree like the toilets here. Just put trees all over them. It'll be fine. Yeah. That's what I like doing with the gaps. I actually learnt this off of a YouTuber called Palsy. If you guys haven't seen his videos, he's very good with Planet Zoo as well. Really good. Like, he's a proper builder. Like, he's very good at his stuff. Unlike some other people we know. <laughs> Not me, obviously. Yeah, I'm, I'm talking about me. Okay, um, I'm gonna get some flowers. I'm gonna make it look real nice. They're taking out their money to spend on me tonight. Oh, okay, let's... Oh, donation boxes. I always forget about those. Hmm. Oh, everything's like dying. Might have to go around next time and actually just buy a load of new animals because I feel like all the exhibits are going to be empty soon. <laughs> this is not going to be good. All right, we've got a couple of donation boxes. This is good. Everybody else, I think, is happy. They're good, I think. Okay, what are we building here? I'm not sure. Maybe we could build another a drinks place or something. We'll see. But the platypus are in. And they are super cute. Look at it. That is the cutest thing. It's just bobbing its way around in life. So cute. Weirdest animal. They are a mammal that lay eggs. But don't we technically all lay eggs? In a really gross kind of way. I don't, I don't know whether I want to talk about that actually. It's pretty gross. Um. Okay, so uh, the, the last, the last melon. The last gemspark. I think there's like one left actually. Oh, it's a stinky. Oh no, there's, there's a, it's had a baby though. So actually, hey, we have a male that will age up and we have a female there. Oh my goodness. Okay, so next episode, I don't know what animal we're going to have in next, but I feel like that was pretty good with the uh, little platypus. I think that's pretty cool. Oh, they're kissing. Are they kissing? I'm not sure. But yeah, so uh, that was successful, guys. It's so cute. I can't give out how cute that is. Okay. Next animal, what are we having? Put it down in the comment section below and we'll get there. Thanks guys so much for watching. Have a wholesome rest of your day. And I'll, uh, yeah, and I'll see you then. Thanks guys. It's actually a wild rest of your day. Wholesome's my other channel. My bad. Bye.